uh, guys, things are getting a little crazy, as you can see. This is supposed to be a peaceful protest. If you got anything to say, come up and talk to us on the side, okay? I'll tell you right now, I'm going to speak to this in a few minutes. There's people walking around with signs saying Lamont is a pedophile, and it's pissing me off. Because I'm going to speak to that. There's a lot of stuff that people don't know about Lamont. And him being a pedophile, I'm sick of hearing it. It's friggin' slander. It's bullshit. Anyhow, let's get uh, Kate Kelly. Sorry. Kate Kelly from uh, National Slam, Canadian National Slam Poet. And she's got a slam poet. She's going to do uh, We Are the Grass and the Grass. Hey. Hello. This is a slam poem that I did a number of years ago. It's so apropos for today and for what's going on today. I heard a hip hop thrash rap band of the Garnet Thursday night talking about a revolution. The evolution of thought like the poets of the 60s with no stoke and all stoke and saying, we are the grass and the cracks pushing through the cemented crust of capitalism and commerce and breaking the ties that bind us to this lonesome time. They were talking about a revolution. Yeah, they were talking about a revolution. Not a storm of Bastille type of deal because we know that will never work. Our hands being tied to the cogs in the wheel, we have become complacent and systematically so. But we are more than mere mechanism. We got the gravel and the guts and the spit in the eye to rise above the everyday hearsay of conditioned thought to remain indivisible by. We are the many outweighing the few. We are the many pushing through. We are the grass and the cracks of mankind. We are the homeowners and we are the homeless. We are the nacho-eating, TV-watching family guy and bachelorette. We are the smokers and the talkers, the drinkers and the thinkers. We are the Greenpeace activists and the Greenpeace activists. We are the mosaic of our place and time. We are the singers and the songs. We are the doctors, the lawyers, the sickness and the crime. We are the diversity we hunger for and the divinity we seek. We are the parent and the child, the wholesome and the weak. We are the grass and the cracks pushing through with the wisdom of the universe whispering in our veins and flexing our collective thoughts like wings. We can rise above the ceiling that holds us in place. Collectively, we are great. We are the strength in numbers that we believe in. We are the beginning and the end. We are flesh and blood. We exist, but we are more than the human frailty of this. We are thought made manifest. We are the grass and the cracks of the sidewalks we walk along. We are the grass and the cracks of the roadways we ride along. We are the grass and the cracks of our own concrete thinking selves, pushing with the persistence of nature into the realms of man, unkind in his plans to wreck the world of wealth. We are the ones we must believe in. We are the solve in the problem. We are the answer to the need. We are Atlas carrying the world on our backs our punishment and pride. We are the custodians and we are the caretakers. We are the makers of our own choices, the takers of our own destiny. We are the many outweighing the few. We are the many pushing through. We are the grass and the cracks of mankind. Indivisible by and growing every day, we the seeds of humanity, blowing in the winds of change. We are the heart of the problem. We are the state of the mind. We are the answers we've been searching for. We are the grass and the cracks of mankind. Thank you and God bless you all. Thank you. Great job, Kate.